गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन वेलकम टू अनदर एपिसोड ऑफ टू द पॉइंट टूडे टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन इज कॉम्पिटिशन कमीशन ऑफ इंडिया दैट इज सी सी आई फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट सी वाई इज इट इन द न्यूज द कॉम्पिटिशन कमीशन ऑफ इंडिया और सी सी आई हैज एक्सटेंडेड द विंडो फॉर सबमिटिंग स्टेक होल्डर कॉमेंट ऑन इट्स प्रपोज रेगुलेशन ऑन टर्न ओवर डिटर्मिनेशन कॉमेंट्स कैन नाउ बी सबमिटेड टिल ट्वेंटी फिफ्थ जनवरी दिस ईयर as against the earlier deadline of 12th january this proposed regulation on turnover is significant as it would have a bearing on how much penalties would be levied on enterprises for their anti competitive conduct now let's discuss what is competition commission of india that is cci it is an independent regulatory body established under the competition act 2002 It is a statutory body with quasi judicial powers. It operates with the goal of promoting and sustaining competition in the market and safeguarding the interest of consumers. Now moving on to composition of CCI. The commission consists of one chairperson and six members who shall be appointed by the central government. The chairperson and every other member shall be individuals of ability, integrity and standing. meeting one of the following criteria a person who has been or is qualified to be a judge of a high court a person with special knowledge and professional experience of not less than 15 years in international trade economics business commerce law finance accountancy management industry public affairs or administration any other individual whom the central government deems to have useful expertise for the commission Now let's have a look at the functions and role of CCI. To eliminate practices having adverse effects on competition, protect the interest of consumers and ensure freedom of trade in the markets of India. To give opinion on competition issues on a reference received from a statutory authority. To undertake competition advocacy, create public awareness and impart training on competition issues. to make the markets work for the benefit and welfare of consumers ensure fair and healthy competition in economic activities in the country for faster and inclusive growth and development of the economy implement competition policies with an aim to effectuate the most efficient utilization of economic resources effectively carry out competition advocacy and spread the information on benefits of competition among all stakeholders to establish and nurture competition culture in the indian economy now it's time for the practice question consider the following statements about the competition commission of india one the chairperson is appointed by the prime minister on recommendation of a special committee two it is a constitutional body which of the statements given above is or are correct one only two only both one and two or neither one nor two send the answer of this question in the comment section stay tuned for the next episode Thanks for watching. Have a great day. For more informative content, like, share and subscribe and do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notifications.